seven day forecast with the angelic ascensions. Oh, all is genuinely well. This may be a reading that may resonate with you if you happen to have Cancer in your sun, moon, rising, or Venus dominant in your natal chart, or if you happen to be cross watching for a Cancerian and you have those placements, this might be the reading for you. There might be some things that might resonate in this reading, and there will guarantee be some things that don't. The things that do not resonate, Cancer, please don't get distracted by these things. Sometimes certain things show up in the reading because they're a message intended for someone else. If it wasn't a message for you, Please don't make any rash decisions based on anything you hear from a general reading. If you would like a reading based on your own personal energy, you can of course book a reading on my website, which happens to be angelicascensionstarot.com. Lastly, Cancers, we are going to go over some topics that are sensitive. And if that's really not your preference, just go ahead and click off. Otherwise, those of you who are ready to take a deep dive with me, Let's look into these channel messages. Vane, Fairfax, Citrus Fruit, CCT Footage, Wisconsin, JC On, Ryan, Kent County, Spa. They went with friends and disappeared. Hail Mary. Um, and what I was seeing and feeling with this Hail Mary situation is that maybe someone was um, doing prayers with um, rosary beads. Maybe someone is Catholic. Maybe someone is in a church. Zenith, citrus fruit, Duncan, arts and crafts, cheese, Allure, Fremont Street, metal detectors. Security guards are surrounding this place. Give me back my stuff. Hey fam buying a soda from the gas station you're not going road ahead closed miami-dade police department king county panda travis they're sending you a call or text david is his brother back home jason has been arrested again jermaine scott county possession of a firearm composite the name's Alex and Andrew. Jeremy knows the truth about this. Wrestling. They still have an item that belongs to you. Please don't cause a scene. It's an automatic. Sycophant. Tramp stamp of approval. Meet me outside. Portland, Oregon. Atlanta, Georgia. Eiffel Tower. SR22 LC. Deja Vu. All right, Cancer Nation, let's see what might be relevant for you over the next seven days. Cancer Nation. Some of you Cancers are pregnant. Or you might hear of news of pregnancy around you. For some of you, this might be a, a secret pregnancy. Somebody might be... Um, maybe not wanting it to be known that they're pregnant um, some could also be going through a depression cancers let's see what's going on for the next seven days cancers you got communication coming in somebody could be reaching out to you cancers or you could be reaching out to um, your child. Maybe your child lives somewhere else. Or it could be this elder that possibly lives somewhere else. You might have some very nosy people in your energy this week. Cancers. Might be a lot of fighting around you. Maybe you're fighting with a Sagittarius. You got somebody around you this week that is very childish. It feels like this is an adult with this childish. Um, some of you could be surrounded by an air sign, an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. Or this would be a Gemini, this King of Swords. We got the lovers. It seems like there's someone that you really love. Cancer. And it seems like you're really stuck on someone. And someone that you're stuck on could be a past person. And maybe there's still curiosity about 
a past person or past situation or it could be this like i said you got somebody meddling in your situation somebody might be overly involved in your situation looking at your relationship it feels like you're going through something money can't seem to stay in your hands this week answer yeah i think somebody might be looking i'm looking at leaving Somebody this week might be getting into some foolishness. You really care for someone, but it feels like the issue is that there is a lack of commitment. This could even be the case in a co-parenting situation. You might feel like you don't know when is the next time you're going to see your co-parenting partner. And, um, yeah. Seems like it has something to do with your child's father. This is either you fighting with your child's father or you've had tension with them in the past. Yeah, somebody is real in their ego this week. Somebody could really be going off on you or yes, thank you. Someone is e easily triggered this week. Yeah, and this feels like this is the reason that you're really annoyed with someone. You feel like somebody is just being extra over the top and they can't seem to calm down. You feel like you can't reason with someone in particular. And it seems like someone this week is popping into the situation, jumping to conclusions. This could be happening at a time when you're at work. Oh, wow. Speaking of work, you definitely have an enemy. Somebody's trying to sabotage you, Cancer or Crosswatcher. You might be feeling this way about someone. This is a love relationship. You might feel like this person does not care about you whatsoever. What's going on with this situation, Cancer? Some of you, I promise you, this is a friend. Yeah. Someone is bringing you a lot of chaos, destruction, taking their trauma issues out on you. It feels like there could be, hmm, is this due to something? I think I see what's going on. Revelation. Someone could be revealing something that's going on this week. Some might be, someone might be shocked about some news that might be coming out this week, Cancer or Cross Watcher. It feels like whatever this is, um, it feels like it, it has something to do with some type of unexpected change. And with something that may happen, it feels like you might be seeing someone's true colors. But since I was saying that you're fighting with someone, okay? Somebody's throwing venomous words out to you. Ten of Swords. Okay, you definitely have an enemy cancer or someone sees you as such. Someone could feel that maybe you're putting some type of curse or hex on them. There's definitely a situation here, cancer, where there's the evil eye being... Um, someone's giving you the evil eye, especially... If you are online, okay, it feels like somebody is looking at you with a lot of anger, a lot of jealousy, or you're feeling this way towards someone. And this is where I feel that someone is trying to sabotage someone. Cancer, maybe you might need to change your, um, pay your internet bill. Okay, yes. Cancer, somebody is, especially if you do have an online presence, someone may see something, come across something that they don't like, and it feels like someone does not want you to succeed. And it looks like if this is you and you happen to be a business owner, it feels like somebody is trying to collapse your business. You have some spying going on apparently some of you this spying is happening online like i mentioned others of you it feels like you're under some type of investigation it could be your family that is under some type of investigation and there could be somebody spying on your home 
your living situation. It seems like someone is going out of their way illegally to maybe dig up some dirt on you, find out some information about you. Could be someone questioning you this week. Mm -hmm. This looks like you're concerned about your safety or someone's safety around you. For others of you, this feels like you might be concerned for your children or your child. You're concerned about the safety of your children or who your, who your child is around. Now for some of you, that's where the fighting is. Maybe your child lives somewhere else. I'm also picking up remote viewing. Like someone is using some type of portal to spy on you now if they're not spying on you literally on your household it feels like somebody is spying through you sp spying on you spiritually possibly through the tarot um this sort of thing but it really does feel like you're under some type of investigation someone is maybe trying to get more information on you but someone is not using the correct use of power in this situation. This feels like this could be someone in authority. I mentioned a father figure, this could be a parental figure. It honestly feels like what goes around comes around. With someone meant for evil for you, Cancer, it feels like something comes back around for someone. But definitely, it feels like some information comes in this week, Cancer, and it hits you kind of hard. Some of you, you could be in some type of legal dispute. Oh, is someone worried about going to jail, doing some type of jail time? Yeah, it feels that way. Yes, you are. You're in some type of legal battle or you're waiting for some type of decision to be made in the court of law. Some of you this week could be getting some type of settlement. If you are in a legal situation or you are in court, you may wanna keep your composure because it seems like someone is searching for some type of character, character flaw so that they can use it against you. Someone is coming at you, Cancer, and they're questioning your ability to take care of or protect children. And this might have you feeling a bit nervous. Okay. If you are going through a legal situation, okay? Yeah, this feels like someone is trying to assassinate your character. I don't know, some of you, you really do fear for your physical safety. This could be you going to court getting some type of restraining order. Either way, if there has been some type of injustice done to you, especially if this has something to do with like domestic abuse, this feels like there's going to be justice in your situation, something it feels like is going to be looked at in a very fair manner. But this feels like because you are trying to protect someone around you, because it feels like cancer, you might feel like you have a lot to lose. So it feels like whatever measures you may need to take to protect someone, it feels like you do. And this feels like it's due to some type of revelation, some type of information that you come across. And it could be you looking into something. And you might see something, Cancer, that, um, where you see the truth about something here. Let's see, let's dive in a little bit more. What's going on for the Cancer Nation? been delays after delays cancer with me being able to get your reading out to you so i apologize but that might be something that you're experiencing a lot of delays a lot of distractions something is trying to keep you from your purpose you might feel gathering aid 
Some of you, you could be getting some type of legal counsel, legal help with something. You might need to. Okay, because it looks like somebody is going out of their way. Yes, thank you, spirit guides. There's, it feels like you may need to defend yourself because of some type of accusation. Spirit guides, tell me more about what's going on for the Cancer Nation. What are you defending yourself against? This could be you feeling angry about something that's revealed. Okay. I'm going to say this. I need to backtrack a little bit. Um, um, I mentioned that cancer, someone's trying to put some type of hex on you, some type of curse on you. Uh, I don't want to say this, but I see it in the reading. It feels as if someone is trying to... I did say sabotage you in some type of way, character assassinate you, make you look a certain way, put present you in a certain light that may not exactly be true. But it, it feels like someone's trying to put some type of curse on you to get you to lose what is valuable to you. For some of you, it's your children. For, for others of you, it's your possessions. It feels like somebody could be trying to get like start a fire physically, like like uh, caught, like doing spell work to cause some type of a fire in your situation. There's a Pisces that shows up to your reading. What are you defending? Okay, you're in court. Are you taking care of someone? It feels like this has something to do with child abuse. Again, you don't trust what someone is doing with your children. Yes, and it feels like you're being accused of something. But in the end, it feels like something is overturned. Or someone doesn't have substantial evidence enough to prosecute someone or rightfully accuse someone this feels like this is a um that could be by trying to say like um law enforcement because i do see someone coming in with some type of abuse of power and cancer you might be a psychic and there might be something that you're able to pick up on, even though it feels like someone is trying to keep you in the dark about something or someone is watching you in secret. It feels like you sense it. And so I think you might be figuring that situation out or some of you, someone could be um, getting exposed this week. I think that's what someone is trying to do. There's so much I see in this reading. Someone cancer is um, a victim of sex SA. And others of you, it feels like you were um, sexually abused by a, a family member as a kid. Or maybe that's what this is. Someone might be questioning whether or not someone is mentally fit to be around children. Cancers. Okay, but the, it feels like there's a lot of um, connections in this reading to children. And someone not being able to contain their temper. This feels like this could also be old trauma that could be bubbling to the surface. It could be childhood trauma that you might be experiencing in your adulthood. It just feels like there's a variety of things going on in your situation. Seems like cancer, you might be behind in your rent. You might owe some money to your landlord, okay? Because you got a Leo in your reading either you are cancer leo 
or you have a Leo that's in your energy this week. You could be getting um, a message from a Leo. A Leo could possibly be dropping by, but it feels like your guides are saying to be mindful of your surroundings this week because it feels as though someone is a bit of a weirdo. Even your surroundings online, you might wanna keep your information protected. Since you have this card talking about protector, yeah? You might wanna protect your energy because uh, your, your information, your personal information, because it looks like cancer, somebody could be going out of their way to get a hold of your information. Especially if this has something to do with money, finances. It seems like someone is really going out of their way to gather information about that. Use your instincts about who you share your personal information with or how much of this is accessible because, again, it feels like someone's going out of their way. Something about, about a per particular situation in your life is going to be revealed. Okay, yep. Yeah someone in a position of power someone is abusing their authority like i said it could be a parent mm -hmm. so i feel like you could possibly be taking to yes taking someone to court right like i said you're waiting for a legal situation you're in some time some type of custody battle or this could be something that might be coming up you could be wondering or um, considering whether or not you should um, do this but i don't know if you have a warrant but i definitely see something with um jail connection here some of you you could be dealing with someone who is incarcerated you could be getting a phone call from someone who could be Okay, yeah, somebody could be getting out of jail or avoiding jail altogether because they have the right defense lawyer. But you wouldn't need a defense lawyer unless someone was accusing you of something. Okay, but it seems like somebody is questioning your morals, your values. Cancer. And someone this week I feel is unhinged. Like they might have like a certified mental illness. Okay. Yeah, you need to pay your electric bill. It feels like you might be behind in bills. You may have fallen behind cancer because that's what this seems like here. Like, um, because maybe you're distracted by maybe a legal situation. If it doesn't have anything to do with kids, it feels like it has something to do with your living situation, where there's a lot of fighting, a lot of turmoil. It feels like these, these, this fighting and turmoil could have something to do with money um, or over children. But yeah, this feels like this could be law enforcement stepping in on behalf of a child. So you might have like a CPS involvement, but it seems like you're able to overcome this situation. Cancer, it feels like something is cited in your favor and you might get some type of um, information about this. There's a court determination that's coming in or some type of good news. Or this is you in the thick of this right now. You're worried about it. You're concerned about it. But in the end, it feels like it, it, it works out in your favor. Somebody is coming up very brash disrespectful and childish this week somebody if you're in a court situation i'm so sorry to linger on this but i feel like somebody needs to like hear this it seems like somebody could be bribing someone to give like a false decision or this is you appealing some type of decision. Somebody's trying to bribe somebody. I think also cancer, somebody might be paying somebody to watch you or vice versa. This is you or someone around you. What's on your mind this week is a, is a financial matter. 
be your living situation. I mentioned that maybe something's going on with your landlord. You owe some money. And so I think you could be going through some type of cash flow issues. You got some snakes around you. I think this is in your work environment. Again, be mindful of who is around you. Yeah, something's on your mind. Something's heavily on your brain. It feels like, like you're under some type of spiritual. It feels as though you're under some type of spiritual attack. Cancer. This is why there is what there's somebody is trying to affect is your money. You got a lot of spirit guides that pop up in your reading this week. So maybe you're calling your calling on your spiritual team, your spirit guides, to help you overcome something that might be going on with your finances. Yeah. That's why your spirit guides show up so heavily to your reading, okay? Your spirit guides are definitely here, okay? Your angels. It feels like you're calling on. They are fighting some type of spiritual battle. That's another thing I was hearing today. It's a song by a group called Snap song that's on Bruce Almighty. The song, well, the, the hook of the song says, I got the power. But the part that I heard playing as a channel message in my head was a part of the song that says, please stay off my back or I will attack and you don't want that. Somebody don't want this smoke cancer. Maybe somebody literally smokes, but it feels like your spirit guides are coming to your defense. Thank you, spirit guides. That's what I'm seeing. Somebody is attacking you, spiritually attacking you out of jealousy. And that's who comes to your defense. That's who, that's who you're getting aid from. Your spirit guides. That's who's coming to defend you with something that you're dealing with. Something that you might feel is just so heavy on your mind or something that is absolutely hidden from you. They come to reveal the truth. This Ace of Swords, the truth is coming to you. It feels like your spirit guides come in to knock down the enemy, your opponent. Because it seems like someone's gotten real greedy, Cancer. And someone feels like they're in control of a situation. Trust and believe me when I say someone is trying to disguise something from you. Either disguise themselves, especially online, cloaking themselves. Spirit guides. What's really going on with Cancers? Somebody's like hiding in the cut. Either way. If this is not you calling on your guides to defend you and fight this spiritual battle that you're going through, then this feels like this is a, the advice to this week. It feels like due to this, you might see some type of movement in your life where there have been some type of delays. The delays have definitely been in your finances due to the fact that someone is trying to curse you or block you in some type of way. Yes, you're about to receive some type of deliverance. Your spirit guides are delivering you from the enemy this week. Okay, because trust and believe me, Cancer, when I tell you, you have an enemy. This may not have been an enemy that you tried to create. You didn't try to trigger someone. Like you didn't deliberately try to piss someone off. Got this card that says self-hatred. This feels like this is due to the fact that somebody doesn't like themselves. So they're trying to mess you up in some type of way by meddling and being all up in your business. Yes. You got another spirit guide that shows up. What is the reason? Mm-hmm. 
Let's say somebody's spying on you through a portal. Somebody's doing like is is either a tarot reader, they're going to a tarot reader, or you're watching some a tarot reader online. This might be going on in the tarot community. There might be someone that's jealous of another tarot reader and pissed and watching them to create their downfall. Yes. Let's make it very clear. You have a stalker, Cancer. Or there's something that you come across. This card that says reveal. As something as if something is revealed to you either in um, as a spiritual message or this is something that you see as a result of something that you come across, maybe in a reading. But it feels like you, you're able to see something. You're able to see who your enemy is. Because it, it seems like um, there's definitely some snakes in the grass, Cancer. Mm -hmm. And somebody that's watching you at your house is your house haunted, Cancer. Some of you might be sending spirits to your house. What is the reason? What's going on with the king? Yes. And it might be a fire sign. I mentioned a Leo. For some of you, this is a Leo. That's there's somebody that just is pissed off. Or you can't stand this person. And that might be the mentally unstable person that I'm talking about. Like somebody comes across something. Somebody is disturbed. Thank you. If this is not a tarot reader. Somebody is trying to do some type of spell work to come find you or um, get you caught up in a legal situation. It feels like someone, Cancer or Crosswatcher, has been doing this for the longest time. Trying to create some type of legal trouble for you or financial situation for you. Yeah. Like someone is trying to block you from something that is your birthright by running their mouth about you. They're trying to block you from having what is supposed to be yours. So they can have it for themselves. Or they're doing this out of greed. It feels like there, there might be multiple other people that could be in on this. Yeah. Trust and believe me when I say there's snakes in the grass. And that's what's being revealed this week. That's what you're going to see. So it may be very necessary to protect your energy because it definitely feels like someone is sending spirits to monitor you, watch you, Cancer. I don't know who's reading this is, but like I said, not all messages may apply. Yeah, somebody is paying somebody to watch somebody. Like somebody has hired some type of like private investigator. Somebody could be driving by your house. So... This goes along with what I was saying to you before. So you, you, you're meant to be a spiritual guide to people. You're someone that's meant to be bring spiritual awareness to people. And it feels like it's for that purpose. Be a relative of yours that might have an issue with you. Yes, thank you, Spirit. It's because of some type of particular talent that you have. That somebody is really taking an issue with you. And somebody's trying to get you to lose out on what, like I said, is rightfully yours. It's like somebody doesn't want you to have some type of success. Or they don't want an outcome to work out for you. And it seems like this week you might be feeling tired. You, you might, this could be your anger. You could be pissed off. Because you feel like someone is being so persistent and so jealous and petty. And you're like, for what? Be 
careful not to lower your standards because it feels like cancer someone is going out of their way to get some type of reaction or this could be a cancer that could be trying to trigger you into some type of reaction to feed their narrative Like I said, it, it feels like someone is maybe trying to get other people to feed into what they're saying. Yeah, and it could be some type of fear tactic. Or this could tempt you to feel afraid. I think someone wants you to be afraid of them. Okay, Holy Spirit, what does this person bring into the situation? What is this? Okay, because okay, it feels like you're under some type of demonic attack makes men fly into passionate rage destroys the happiness of married couples waste the beauty of earth reveals the future okay definitely with this card talking about reveals the future somebody is going to a tarot reader with this wheel of fortune it's like somebody wants to know what your destiny is so that they can block it destroys married couples somebody might be pissed off that either you're married or that um, someone may want to return to their ex i'm telling you like since i don't mean for it to sound this way but i gotta deliver the message yeah that's what this is Makes one wise and teaches everything. Can turn any metal into gold. Transmutes water into wine. Answers questions about the past, present, future. Grants favor of friends and foes. Someone is trying to get some type of favor in court. Even though they're, being, they're, they're making deals in the background going about something in a very illegal way yeah this is your spirit guy stepping in to defend you if this is some type of spiritual worker like a root worker that you're going to for some of you someone is false they're a phony and somebody could be putting a hex on you so that you come to them and they can clear the hex and they're going to charge you money for it. Breaking the circle lifts opposing barriers, brings victory. So again, with this spiritual battle that your angels are fighting for you, whether or not this is something that you're going through in the spirit realm, and which I feel that it is. I feel like it started there and it's 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 um it has something to do with people's choices here on this this earthly plane your guides are ensuring that there is a victory for you causes harmony and peace calms anger in anyone so maybe this is you praying for something praying for someone calms the anger in anyone your spiritual team definitely has the ability to come to your defense cancer or cross watcher it's just going to be up to you to call on them because it feels like they are surrounding you or someone that you might be attacking cancer So you could be getting a car. Um, maybe it's time to get a new car, cancer. Something could be going on with the engine of your vehicle this week. And it might be necessary for you to look into getting that fixed. If it's not your car, it might be someone else's around you. Um, you might be receiving a package or a letter might be coming in for you this week. Um, some of you, you could be going outside. Maybe you might be deciding to travel by skateboard, random money has been blocked or has been held up it feels like by some type of spiritual um work that you're doing it feels like you're able to manifest the money that you need 
Okay. Remember, your spirit guides are delivering you. They're providing some type of deliverance. This is this is you getting something delivered as well to your home. Maybe food. Like I said, a package could be coming through after completion. Yeah. It feels like you're waiting for something to complete or wrap up. And it feels like your guides are saying patience. It feels like they want you to hold it together. And if there has been some money that's been held up, it feels like it's being dispersed to you this week. Or you could be getting some type of message about some type of money coming through that you've been waiting for. Children are the center, central focus of your reading. I promise you somebody's watching you and they're trying to act like they're not watching you. Children are the central focus of your reading this week. So some of you could definitely be um, reaching out to your children. Or you might have adult children that could possibly be reaching out to you. It seems like if you are having, you got this card that's talking about gathering aid. If you've been having some type of financial issue, it feels like there's um, people that step in to give you some type of help. It feels like support, this could be coming in as, as a way of support, emotional support. But this feels like this is also money coming to you. Like there could be... Um, some type of financial assistance coming your way. Maybe you're collecting, maybe you're waiting for an unemployment check and it comes through the mail this week, Cancer. Um, if this is you being a business owner and it seems like maybe you've been struggling with your business, it feels like some investors could be coming through. You're being well paid to do something. There might be job opportunities, employment opportunities that could be opening up for you. But it feels like there is the ability for something to change by you speaking to your guides about something that you're going through. You might need to get your spending underway, okay? Maybe it could be, you could possibly be laying out a budget and seeing where you can cut corners. But I, I feels like if you haven't been able to pay off some bills, like I said, some money gets sprinkled into your account and you're able to pay some things off. Relationships feel like they might be, you might be going your separate ways from someone or someone could possibly be um, deciding to move out. You got this card that says shock. And this card that says revelation as if some type of information comes through this week. Okay, you might see something, hear about something, Cancer, that shocks you. What is it that is shocking? What are you shocked about? Someone might be shocked to see you. What are you shocked about? Yeah. Somebody might be shocked by your come up. What is Cancer shocked about? Okay. It feels like whatever you're shocked about. It could have something to do with your kids. It could have something to do with some news that comes in this week. This news could be poss possibly popping up as um, something that, that comes up in your, in your dream. Whatever this news is, you might need to wait for something. But it seems like temporarily something causes you to feel trapped. Or this has just been how you've been feeling lately. Yeah. You may need to do a road opener. You may need to do a spiritual cleanse of your house. Cancer, it feels like some, like it's your household or energy that's being sent to your home that is creating some type of blockage. It feels like it's due to the evil eye. If this is due to some type of job loss, it feels like, and that's what's had you in limbo for a while, it feels like you get some type of answer some of you, it feels like you're making a decision about stepping out of a very re repetitive job or something about your schedule that you may need to change. 
for some of you this is this has something to do with a health situation cancers it feels like some of you might need to go and get a checkup when it comes to a heart condition it feels like somebody could have hypertension or you're not feeling well which is also something that somebody is sending you you might be having a lot of headaches a lot of foggy thinking you feel like you can't think straight someone or you you feel like your um, your um, your enthusiasm your motivation is down you're under some type of spiritual attack someone is watching you your angels are watching out for you truthfully but it seems like Something from another dimension is being sent. Anyway, this has something to do with a health situation. It feels like you could possibly be changing something about your health. It might require you to do some more research. But if it feels as though something is... Someone is able to recover from something that... Um, Maybe someone wasn't expecting someone to pull through from. And it could be a health situation that has you in fear. Cancer or cross watcher. Some of you, it feels like there's a loved one that may be visiting you in spirit that might be around you. And they could possibly be trying to warn you about someone that is around you. Careful about overloading yourself, giving so much to the point of feeling ill. You may want to save, okay, cancers, because it while this money is coming in, you might want to put some away. Holy Spirit, what is the advice? for the Cancer Nation. The power of spirit exists in all things. Everything is made of energy and every single thing in your physical world contains a fragment of spirit, including you. We are all one with spirit and will always be connected to one another. Spirit is with you and whatever challenge that you might be going through, this week, Cancer, your spiritual team wants you to know that they're backing you. They're here for you. They're here at your beck and call. If you're here, call on your guides. It's almost over. Your current challenges will soon be resolved. And you'll be able to look to the future with a smile. You, whatever challenge that you're facing this week, because you do call on your spiritual team, you're getting ready to see that something is wrapping up. It is getting resolved, or it will be resolved soon. That's some type of deadline. It feels like you're racing against the clock to get something done this week. There's something you need to turn in or give. You've listened to your inner voice. You've listened to your inner guidance and made a wise choice. Keep moving forward. Yes, your spirit guides will show up in the week. The right answer will show up in the form of your intuition, your inner guidance. They're pressing you to keep moving forward. Cancer, a cross watcher, because something is almost over. You're almost at the finish line and it feels like your prayers are being answered. Your prayers have been received by the divine. Answers will come soon, although perhaps in forms you didn't expect. It could be in this reading that maybe that shows up in a form that you, that the answer shows up in a form that you didn't expect, or somebody drops by and gives you something that you need, or you happen to come across something in, in your dream or your daydream in some type of way. With that, Cancer Nation, this concludes your seven-day forecast with Angelic Ascensions. This reading was helpful to you, Cancer Nation. Help me out by giving this reading a thumbs up. 
consider subbing to my channel if you are not already a subscriber. If you do decide to subscribe, make sure that you hit that post notification bell so that you are notified whenever I upload a video for a sign that you're cross-watching for or whenever I go live. Thank you, Cancer Nation, for deciding to join me this week. Have a blessed, peaceful, and productive week, Cancer Nation. I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out. Thank you.